Hello everybody and welcome back. Um, we have a EMS chief buggy here for a department down in the San Francisco Bay Area. And uh, we are going to do a quick walk around, then we'll kind of go through the inside and show you what we did. And as we get started in the front, you'll see we have four light heads in the grill that form a X pattern with red and white. Uh, we have the visor lights in the um, upper part of the front windshield. We have LED light heads um, right above the electric fold down running boards, uh, lights behind the uh, side glass on the back. And then we have the you know standard tail light flasher with a LED uh, traffic advisor that has the emergency flash pattern. And we also have those little light heads that we put below the hatch um, and those are multicolor as well. So we added two of them um, to the front lower part of the front bumper so that we can um, have intersection um, lights um, when the nose of the vehicle uh, first breaches into the intersection. Okay, so now we'll move into the inside. And first you'll see on the door panels, we installed uh, light heads that flash when the uh, door is open. That way, um, if the driver or any of the occupants um, step out into a roadway when they open the door, you avoid collision um, for the vehicles that are traveling down. Uh, here is your siren controller. You have a three-stage pursuit switch, a uh, six-button, which is actually a multi-button. The more, the more times you push it, you can cycle through different um, flash patterns and things like that. You had a, a Blue Sea um, dual battery system installed with an um, auto-charging relay. Here is the remote heads for your radios, your mobile radios. Um, we put them in there um, so that they're easy to access, but also discreet, um, so you're not going to have them sitting in the sun and people can see in. And then there is the microphone for your PA system. Okay, so this is probably my favorite part of this build. This is our custom you know, cabinetry storage solution that we put together. We can customize any kind of uh, you know, cabinetry, storage, slide outs, you know, that you're looking for. This is uh, just something that we really pride ourselves in doing. Uh, this one, you know, being for an EMS chief, there was, a, you know, some storage options that we needed. So we built this uh, truck bed slider. You know, it's basically something similar to that. It is a storage shelf that is on, um, you know, door sliders. And it will come out and it's about four feet long. Now the whole thing is linexed, so you don't have to worry about you know like water damage seeping in to the system. It's you know completely waterproof, and you're going to be able to store you know PPE, EMS bags, you know anything that they're going to be carrying on a day-to-day -day basis. You're going to be able to put right here and have really easy access to. Instead of trying to reach into the buggy and grab it, you can just pull a slide out out, and it's it's right there. Now, once again, because this is for an EMS chief, you know, they're, they're going to be commanding scenes. And so they have remote uh, heads in the back, as well as their microphones with magnetic mics. You have an EMS uh, narcotics safe. And then we also have, um, you know, power and USB chargers. Um, in the back of the hatch, you have the speakers for those radio heads. So the sound will play, you know, right above you. You're not going to have to like lean into the buggy and try to hear what's going on. Uh, we also have work lights that we installed. Uh, it's those same little LED light heads. They're dual color from white to red. So if it's at night and you don't want to blind yourself, you know, you just turn on the red lights. Um, we also have a secondary uh, siren controller in the back. So in the event that you want to, you know, at, turn on more lights or turn off lights, uh, you're going to be able to do that from the rear. And the bottom of the storage um, compartment is your command board. So this pulls out, you have a whiteboard in there, but you also have a clear piece of plastic on top. So if you wanted to drop, um, you know, like say building designs or, you know, like layouts or wh whatever you're planning on to like worksheets, you can, um, you know, use the whiteboard feature of, of the clear plastic on top of that and fill out the form that way instead of like, you know, having to open the file drawer and pull out, you know, a worksheet. Before we go, I just want to go through really quickly the uh, scene lighting features of all these LEDs that we put on this build. So once again, all of the light heads are dual color or tricolor. And like here's your visor lights that can be used as additional scene lighting. The LEDs above the um, you know electronic fold down running boards, the LEDs in the rear, um, the little light heads, all red white. Uh, here's that additional siren controller I was talking about. And what I want to show you here is you know, you have your whole rear scene lit up. So you have above the hatch and you have down below. 
Now, one th cool thing about this is that you had those little light heads. We also wired them up to act as additional brake lights and reverse lights if needed. So that was one little unique thing we had done there. So that's about it for this video. Uh, let us know how we're doing in the comments, and uh, we're going to be back here with a new video very soon. For more information on Derotic Emergency Equipment and the services we offer, contact us. 844-433-7684 or email info at